Hello everyone, thank you for checking out today's video. Today I'm going to be reviewing a great professional development resource for teachers and really anyone who works in the public school system. Of course, this resource is the Kahoot Certified Training Course. And there is um, Kahoot Certified for schools, bronze level, silver level, as well as gold level. I have completed in the past week all three levels of the Kahoot Certified for Schools. First step, go to kahoot.com slash certified and create an account. You will see that it will bring you to a page where you can read more about Kahoot Certified for Schools. And basically in the bronze level, you learn how to navigate the Kahoot platform and you learn how to launch a Kahoot game. Then in the silver level, you are able to learn how to create a Kahoot from scratch, add multimedia, add GIFs and videos, and access different Kahoot reports. And then finally at the gold level, you can learn how to use Kahoot for formative assessment, understand how to revise Kahoot, create Kahoots on your smartphone. And there's also advanced certification courses, such as data-driven instruction, connected Kahooting, master Kahoots, and even more training that they are going to be added. There's also webinars on Kahoot for educators. And I'm going to be attending one of these conferences next week, getting the most out of Kahoot, back to school refresher of Kahoot, and um, there's all these different resources. Now, of course, I would like to show everyone what the badges look like and the certificates once you have finished the Kahoot for Educators program. Let's see if when I log into my account, I should be able to see um, my different certificates. I really enjoy using Kahoot because as a student in college, I use Kahoot as well as as well as in the middle school where I worked at, we used to use Kahoot. Now let's look in here. We can open up this is with the bronze. And you also get a little badge, may or may not be in here. Gold course, you, once you complete that, and more about different types of assessments. Using Kahoot, Kahoot should never be used for summative assessments. The badge for Kahoot should be pulling up. It looks like this. You can add that to your email signature, which is what I did. And of course, if your district allows for out of district points, then you can earn out of district professional development points, which is allowed in my district. The Kahoot learning 